There is a sense of unease because so far the inspection team have not yet registered any measurements of radioactivity above the natural background level. Does that mean there was definitely no nuclear detonation? No, uh, there's a possibility of complete containment of every atom. So we would say in the radionuclide business we can't prove a negative, but we feel that we can prove a positive. The inspection team will know by the end of the day if the Executive Council has decided to call off the on-site inspection. In the meantime, they keep taking measurements and going on field missions. The Inspector's State Party has the right, within limits, to assign areas off-limits for investigation, each called a Restricted Access Site, or RAS, and they have assigned a new RAS in the north of the inspection area. However, the recent data analysed shows some seismic activity in the area of this RAS and the inspection team have asked to drive nearby. The inspected state party eventually agree, but insist there must be only visual observations. The inspection team has other ideas, however. We couldn't do any sampling at all within the quarry, they're very insistent on that. So my thinking with my sub-team leader was that we'd take a, a sticky smear from the actual tyre of the, of the um, vehicle that had actually driven through the quarry. So any residue that was in the quarry was at least going to get some of that. And they looked quite surprised when we'd done it as well, but they didn't object. By the end of the day, the call to cancel the inspection hasn't come. So the inspection now moves into the continuation period they will now be able to use a wider array of equipment, mostly geophysical, to make more detailed investigation of the area. Are the inspected state party getting nervous? No filming. Find out next time.